Okay. So, I think this is going to be my last video for a while. I think. But I wanted to get those Cinco de Mayo dances in there. Um, and hopefully when I come back it'll be more structured and scheduled but I think I'm doing okay so far with my communication so spirit I'm not doing anything on purpose like and I've had that issue before there is something going on because you said you sent it your email and your number to me 15 times I do not have it I check my email to spam but on my video I I, I uh, put it on private because I guess I was I don't know what the hell I was talking about but I got a feeling I was just talking about too many different things but you saw I was showing myself talk and my volume just went away while I was talking about a specific thing then it came back you know so that doesn't help if your computer and your your um, stuff is getting tampered with or if it just don't work we don't know or and if you have whatever I had going on in my background at one point which I'm so glad I'm free of that but that was not easy and I did that alone I'm saying what's happening with me alone regardless of and I'm going to tell you, I went to a store in Brunswick, and when I went to that store, um, I think I was on my way out. And, and certain people can hype, I don't care, I, I, I don't care, I feel like, like I understand what's going on right now, and it's hurtful. I got real disgusted with humanity for a while. Who is going to take care of our children? Who? If adults can do each other any type of way. In my opinion, ain't nobody shit. I'm going to be honest. Working to where and that's why I think the ones that's doing these news and these media stories reading these I had to sit and read trauma stories they weren't story oh my god um the thing is if you working in these fields self-care when I worked in the military I didn't understand self-care I just was doing the job and after I left the job I was really depressed and then having these awakening that there was things that was just so contradictory to my culture. It just was ridiculous. And I still go back to what I said about what I feel like with this world and the men and adults. Ultimately, I feel like these issues were men fault. And whoever's the man in power right now need to make a change. So, who decides who's going to take care of our adults and what type of adults? Who decides that? So, when you have your own and your own everything, like I saw on Facebook, one of my brothers on there, and he was looking bedazzled. He was looking good. And I'm glad. I'm I'm glad that he was looking good but even them was they were discussing like I'm disgusted I'm disgusted so those children because I always even though I have a large family, I was the black sheep. So I always felt like I was there alone by myself during certain situations that I did not understand.
so when I see oh god I don't think adults got the right to manipulate each other and do no bullshit just stay the fuck away from certain type of people and I'm taking a YouTube and a whole internet break because that trafficking thing and all of that that was just kind of deep but we don't it's look like some people don't have mercy it just doesn't matter you know um low vibration dealing with um anyway i'm going to cleanse my body of all of that but the negativity like I've, I've sit and listen and watch some really bad things and then we always from coming from what I'm coming from we've always had men back and anybody that I've spoke about I never said anything they can't say it because they they know that they were doing something too and it's not funny um let me go to my friend okay so my friend from my hometown she uh likes young rich and african i haven't seen that show but i heard about it um she likes that and I'm mentioning that because I was trying to explain to her the differences in people and the type of person I am and just certain you know things that might be important and going overseas um, especially the market area the market areas when you go overseas they're pretty similar um, the um, Iraq market area and Korea market area and the way they do things there and the village just market area is kind of similar you know get your stuff and go if that if you don't want to be bothered with anything um, and so I'm telling her uh, how I am and she knows me so she can the struggles that I had will probably be her strength so I think maybe I'm finding my soul tribe and she's like I'm ready I'm ready so I'm hoping to have a partner because I really need somebody you know and not in no abusive manipulative as way it's good for somebody to have your back you know and I pray for everybody rest in peace and please don't disrespect the dead because they ain't going nowhere you know and I'm glad I didn't get I toned certain things down and certain things I did hide um, some might not agree with all of my etiquettes but who nobody doing shit to solve it nobody's saying a solution the only solutions they got in like what's best for me all mine all mine and then you and then we'll tell somebody else or a child or a person whoever to they jealous because they probably don't have a community or a family they don't have a mother or a father or you know they don't they not gonna be able to look within themselves and handle things alone and just keep it going and then realize that they're hated by somebody that they love what the fuck and then a definition of love that this world teach which men are supposed to be in charge of they teach us the worst shit so as far as I'm concerned martial arts uh I'm going to continue to do what I do. Martial arts class. Uh, women and children. And for people who don't know how to protect themselves. Because everybody don't. So those words. I remember when certain things. Um, the fucking college situation. I go. I go.